HCF of 825, 675 and 450. It seems to be quite complicated but let's see how we can make it very easy. First of all, I'm going to observe the last digit of the three numbers that is 5, 5 and 0. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to use the divisibility of 5. And let's divide all these three numbers with 5. So this is going to be 165. Then divide 675 by 5. So the answer is going to be 135. And then 5 times 90 is 450. So again, I will observe the last digits of the numbers. So this is 5, 5 and 0. So using the divisibility of 5, these three numbers are going to be divided by 5. And let's write 5 again here and divide these three numbers with 5. So it's going to be 33, then 27 and then this is going to be 80. So now I have these three numbers and the last digits are not 550 so I'm going to use the divisibility of some other number let's see how I'm going to use the divisibility by 3 so here we'll see if you'll remember the table of 3 these three numbers can be divided by one single number that is 3 so let's write 3 here again and divide these numbers with 3 so 3 times 11 is 33 and 3 times 9 is 27 and 3 times 6 is 18. Now the numbers that I have are 11, 9 and 6. 9 and 6, they are the common factors. Again, 3. But 3 is not common factor of 11. So it means now further I can't get the common factor for 11, 9 and 6 except 1. So what is going to be my HCF? I'm just going to multiply these numbers 5 multiplied by 5 multiplied by 3. This is gonna be 75. So 75 is the HCF of these three numbers.